Hi everyone, it's um, August the 23rd, 2024, and I have words of the Lord from today, and I'm just going to um, say a quick prayer and get started. Lord Jesus, I thank you, Father, for your words, your guidance, and direction. Lord, I pray for all those that are going to hear this message, that they pray about everything, take everything to you, pray for discernment, understanding, and revelation, and seek you with all of their heart, mind, and soul, Father God. I plead the blood of Jesus over my brothers and sisters, Lord, their homes, their jobs, their coming and their going, Father God, their families and their children, Lord that they would seek you, know you, want you, love you, and serve you all the days of their life, Father. I pray for the lost, Lord, that they would be seeking you and seeking truth, not leaning on their own understanding. Lord, I pray for the body of Christ that we would come together in one accord, one heartbeat, seeking you with all of our heart, mind, and soul, coming together, no discord between brothers and sisters in the name of Jesus. I give you all glory, honor, and praise, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Okay. Um, this is going to be a very short message, um, short and sweet. T Tell my children to seek my heart now, child, like never before. It is imperative they live in a they live in a wicked generation where evil is normalized. My children do not know the difference. Many have conformed to this world, but many will awaken. As I say, it is so. Come to my light, O lost generation. I am your only way. I love you more than comprehension. Apart from me, it is impossible, but with me, all things are possible. Believe it, know it, walk in it. It is the way. Want my ways, pray for my will. That's something that we should be praying all day, every day, praying for God's will in our lives. The devil is a liar. Do not believe the lies, children. He knows the weaknesses. Pray over them. I am strong where you are weak. Abide in me. I will abide in you. My ways are higher. Call on me day in and day out. I love you all, both great and small. Abba, Father, shalom, my children. And the scriptures will be down at the bottom. Um, along with this, um, the way to abide is to come to him daily, praying every day all day every day you can pray driving washing dishes cooking whatever it is you can be praying all day um read your bibles read not just a few scriptures here and there you need to be reading chapters getting in and not snacking on it like he said on yesterday's message feasting on it feasting that means chapters enjoy it know it um pray over it pray for discernment pray for tell the lord Teach me, Lord, I don't know anything. Teach me what you need me to know. Give me revelation. That's what I pray. Um, I pray for revelation. I pray to be taught by Holy Spirit every day. Um, fast, that's going to help you. Shed this world because our way of thinking in this world is so different than than how it should be walking with the Lord. Um Fasting helps you get closer. It cleanses you from the inside. There's all five different chambers. There's so many ben benefits. If you want to get close and you feel you're far away, the fastest way is to do a three-day cleanse. Um, it cleanses you. It takes everything out. It brings you closer. But with that, you need to be praying, worshiping, and reading your Bible. It's not just stop eating. You have to abide in Him and turn down this world. That means like the music, the TVs. Um, it all of those things are distractions and it's static it, it when you're in all of that it's hard to hear the word the, the um the lord it really is um it's a very thin line that's how i used to see it at the beginning it's a thin line we're all in with the lord or we're back and forth and it's it's static to me that's how i see it um commune with the lord do homage that means getting on your hands and knees and and be, praise praising the lord praising the lord for your day praising him for your daily breath praising him for for all that you were allowed to do this this day all all the blessings that we have we have blessings in our day that we don't even acknowledge being able to walk is a blessing because there's people that cannot the the fact that you have a home um you have all your necessities because he takes care of us. Um, 
pray and thank the Lord for everything and um, come in every day and talk to him every morning every night and in between seek him like never before like he said it is imperative you need to seek my heart now like never before it is imperative so god bless you i love you guys have a good night um i love you <laughs>